Hi, my name is Sarah Cox. Welcome again to my low carb vegetarian kitchen where we make food fast without it being fast food. Now today I'm going to show you the quickest and easiest mushroom soup. Um, we've just got a few ingredients here. Mushrooms, obviously. Uh, I've got about oh, 11 or 12 cups of mushrooms. It works out to be about 500 grams. And I've also got some celery. I've got about 7 or 8 cups of celery. I've just got that diced up pretty fine. And one, one whole onion. I'm going to use some ground chilli and some uh, minced garlic and beef sock cubes, which are actually vegan beef sock cubes. They're beef style sock cubes. Right, then I'm just going to start by putting about a tablespoon of oil into the hot pan. And I'll put a teaspoon or so of garlic into that. I'm going to stand back while I do that. It goes everywhere. Alright, <laughs> pretty quick smile. I'm going to dump the onions on top. And I'm going to stir that. <laughs> it's going to burn to the bottom. And I'm going to add just a tiny little bit of water because it burns. <laughs> You can't see what I'm doing in here, but <laughs> yeah, they're looking pretty brown. Maybe that's because they got burnt, or they could be starting to cook. Okay, and we'll put on top the celery. There's a few onions left. <laughs> And they'll just steam and soften up the, um, the celery a little bit. I'm going to leave that for about a minute. I'm going to wander off and do something else. So I'm going to stop the recording. I'll come back in about a minute and we'll continue. Right, now those um, celeries are starting to look a bit soft now. They're not, they're not that soft. They're still, still firm, but the crispiness is starting to go out of them. And I'm ready to put in my mushrooms. And well, I've, cut them. I've actually, actually left the stalks on. Yeah, there's no need to take the stalks off. It's extra time and waste. And I'm going to put a, just a sprinkle of chilli. I'm going to be very careful not to put too much or I won't be able to eat the soup when it's done. I'm going to put in uh, one of these vegan beef sock cubes. The, the brand is Massel Brands. I'm not sure if you can get them in America. Um, you'll have to look around, do some research in the grocery store. And on top of that, I'm going to put three cups of water. There's two cups. I'm being good and I'm using filtered water today. Normally I just get it straight out of the tap, but yeah, why not try some proper filtered water? leave that there for about 10 minutes or so. Shouldn't take any longer than 10 minutes and I'll, I'll be back when we're ready to start blending the soup. Okay, we're just about ready now for the fun bit. I've been about 15 minutes. Um, this is looking pretty good. Now I'm just turn that off, give it a stir. Look 
and see what, what that looks like. Nice and nice and cooked. And now, this is probably not the best thing to do, but I'm going to blend, put it in the blender. It's still quite hot. Let's <coughs> rest it up on top of the blender because it's easier. Less spillage. Now while I was gone, did some calculations on my computer. 17 grams of carbs, the whole whole recipe. Now you, you'll get you know, at least five serves out of this, at least. So yeah, I, I can't, I'm not that good at maths, but you, know, you wouldn't, wouldn't be any more than five grams in each serve, so this is a pretty good soup. <laughs> And that is it. This is the finished soup. Looking beautiful there. It looks bad, but it tastes really, really good. So people are going to freak when they see this soup, but when they taste it, they'll completely change their mind. Okay, you've been watching my low carb vegetarian kitchen, and I'll see you next time.